welcome back to Amy Explains. I am still Amy Fox. Uh, some things in life change, other things don't, apparently. Um, so this week, Eric Bulo asks, huh, what did we think about the South Park transgender episode? Okay, well, first of all, there have been a few South Park transgender episodes, but I bet Eric's talking about the good one where Cartman is trying to use the girls' bathroom. And this sounds like a nightmare. When I'm pitching this, this sounds like it's going to be just god-awful because previous South Park episodes and comedy in general have not been very kind to trans people like Professor Garrison who has changed back and forth from genders a few times was not a very good trans ambassador fictitious character with again no trans people in it <clears throat> um, nor was there dolphinoplasty particularly a nuanced way of exploring you know gender dysphoria however the one about Cartman trying to use the girls washroom was actually really good I cannot believe I am saying this. Um, they have a direct, like almost to the camera, exposition of what the word cisgender means and why it is important to use it. Um, one of the other characters starts questioning their own gender identity in a way that's realistic and cool, albeit very brief. And they still get the comedy out of it while making very clear that Cartman is not transgender. Cartman just wants their own washroom that no one else can use. Um, which is again a reference to one of the problems that a lot of trans kids actually have in schools. It's like, no, you're only allowed to use that one washroom halfway across the school. So I really liked it. Um, there are different ways of approaching humor. Um, and some are like the switch, I like to think, are very nuanced in trying to be respectful. And others are a little more like rough and tumble. South Park is like that. My favorite trans character on television is actually formerly Dr. Girlfriend, now Dr. Mrs. the Monarch on Venture Brothers. Venture Brothers, questionable politics, especially in the first season, but that's a really kick-ass, amazing trans character in a kind of bro comedy. So, there we go. Oh, right, I'm Amy Explains. No, shit, I'm messing it up. 